Good afternoon everybody, this is Nelka again and as promised, I will uh, show you again another amazing feature of the Lux Evo 8.0 version and that is on how to use a JPEG file or a picture image as your base plan in your Dialux Evo. So for example, I have here one image. This is what I get from the client. And this is from the J uh, PDF file. And what I did is I just screen open the PDF file and then screenshot it and then paste the screenshot into uh, paint and then save that paint into uh, desktop and then I open it in um, Photoshop. And because, because the picture is a little crooked or it's not aligned, so what I did is I open it in Photoshop so I can align it. So when I traced it in uh, Dalax Evo, it will be straight. So here is the uh, sample image now. So this is open now in uh, Photoshop. So I'll go and unlock this one so I can rotate it because you can see the a little ali the alignment is not a little that it's not that correct. So I'll go and uh, drag one more uh, line here. Just click to the ruler and drag one more line there. And you can see in this one, it's not that so much aligned. So I'll go and control T and align it like this. Okay. Yeah. So I think this is fine now. So go ahead and enter. Fine. So I'll go and save this one in my desktop save as and then i'll go to my desktop and say i will say this one as the car showroom and then we'll save it as jpeg file and then save so yes press ok so once you save that one and you aligned it properly you have to make sure that vertical and horizontal is properly aligned so just don't forget to uh, go to the view and show the extras and ruler and then you can just drag and uh, drop all those guidelines or rulers so you, you can double check that one and then control T to rotate it a little or skew it a little all right so now I, I open now my Dialux Evo file and I'll go to outdoor and building planning and now I will insert my image as a base plan so go to your file go to the import and select the plan and then it will ask you where you will get those drawings so go to the desktop and say car showroom and say open and then ta -da! now this is your this is going to be your base plan and then it will ask you a little thing on your uh, upper right corner so it says origin and rotation so for example i will just use this one as my um, orientation and origin so I select like this so it will be my orientation or the base plan and then specify the scale okay so you can see here when you zoom it it says 9000 mm or 9 meters so what I'm going to do is I will just select one point here and there okay and I will say this is I will type here on this corner little one there it is 9 meters and then enter and then if I want to finish it, I can just click this one. Or if I want to check it, I can check it and by pressing it here, check the length. I'll say it like that. So it's 9 meter. So it's correct. And then I'll say finish. Now, my, my J, JPEG file is now uh, properly scaled. And you can see it there. Amazing, right? So when you trace your um walls and windows of course you just need to follow this one you don't need to be so precise and then you can have your um drawing so i think i already made an example here okay let's just wait for that one and then um of course go to the basic again uh, create your floor element like this and then create your first building pressing this one and then trace your first walls. Forget the columns for now and just trace your walls. Okay, so if it's a little skewed, see it's not still aligned, but this is now offset and you can see that the, the line is proper aligned. So you can adjust it again in your Photoshop if you like. So what I'm going, I'm doing right now is I'm tracing now the 
walls of this car showroom okay so for example i've made it already i will just close it right click and close polygon and then when i go and create the interior so i will just create my first new room for example this one okay you don't need to be precise for this for this moment but you can check the depth and the thickness of your wall later if you really want to check it so yeah so this is how you do your uh, tracing uh, using the jpeg file as a base plan for your dialux evo let's see what i did here so this is what i did and you can see now that i trace it from the jpeg file amazing right so yeah that's it and i hope you like the new feature of dialux evo and of course if you want to learn more of some tips and tricks just visit my um, website www.enrocolightingdesign.com or enroll in my courses in www.udemy.com and yeah if you want to get some vouchers or promo codes in this udemy courses you can also check me in my facebook account nelka roco so see you again later bye